Kenny Green concrete and steel, keeping it good and raw, keeping the people informed on what's happening. Let's go to this story right here, right? Huntsville, Alabama, limestone correctional facility, harvesting body parts. Let's talk about it. A 43-year-old man <clears throat> named Brandon Dotson found dead in his cell. Autopsy was done on Brandon. His body was sent home with no internal organs. You understand what I'm saying? When the family received the body, there were no organs in it. Now, for those that know and don't know, during the autopsy, they sometimes remove the organs, but they placed them back. His family received his body with no organs and massive decay, open casket, not possible because the skin slippage, that means the body was decomposing in a way that the skin just fell apart. So that takes some time. So clearly this body was held. There's litigation going on. But this is what I, I like to, you know, <clears throat> excuse me, address to the people. Sometimes we have loved ones in uh, medical facilities, nursing homes, prisons. And sometimes when they see that there's no contact back and forth, that loosens up the accountability that they may have to live in. And understand, organs are now becoming a hustle. So someone needs a heart, someone needs a liver, a kidney, different things. People are hustling organs now. So we really need to understand that because sometimes some things be so atrocious that our minds can't comprehend them. But guess what? There are minds out there that do comprehend them. And they make it their business, their plan to take advantage of people that don't seem like they have a support system. So when you have loved ones or even friends or family members, you have to check in. We already know there's abuse in these nursing homes. We know there's abuse in these prison systems. We know there's abuse all over. And a lot of times I would think that they probably look at the record of visitors, look at who's being tended to, what family members are uh, making them accountable and if they don't see no record, then that is a candidate that people will not complain about. If they come up missing or if certain things are done to them, they would not expect a recourse. Mind you, at this prison, they still operating in the chain game. Now, we saw old movies, the chain game. Well, guess what? In some places, this is still occurring. So understand what's not happening in your life and your area and people you know it may be happening somewhere else and sometimes if we don't do certain things to slow that momentum down like water spills man it'll hit things that you didn't expect it would hit if you can't catch the spill concrete and steel